It is time to test my 1873 rifle with my black powder cartridges. I'm going to shoot 5 cartridges reloaded with 19th century ideal tool and 5 cartridges reloaded with modern press and die set. The distance is 50 meters, the rifle is uberty and this is the first 5 cartridges made with the ideal reloading tool. If you watched my previous video, you already know that the bullets made by the mold of the tool are too small for my bore. They are only 0.417 inches in diameter, while I need at least 0.427 according to the bore dimensions. We'll see if the gases can upset the bullet into the rifling or not. Okay, so this is the group size of the five cartridges I loaded with the ideal tool. The bullet is too small, the cartridge is odd, but still the rifle is able to hit a head size target at 50 meter with this cartridge as well. Well, I've seen worse group sizes at 50 meter with modern rifles and modern cartridges, so I think that's not such, such a bad thing. But let's check it out how the rifle performs with my 4440 best reloaded cartridges made for the professional target shooting. Let's see. And here comes the second 5 shots. I loaded my cartridges with maximum precision using Starline Brass, Lyman 240 grains bullets, size to 427 and Swiss 3F powder. I did all the best I can to make 100% uniform cartridges. By the way, in the next part I will show you the process I reload my 4440 black powder ammo with modern tools. But now this is the moment of truth. Now this is much better, this is up to modern standards. You see four shots in the same hole, and only one is here, and that was not the problem of the rifle, not the mistake of the rifle or the cartridge, that was me. So, this is my cartridge for the 4440 Uberti Winchester, and this is why I love this rifle and love this ammunition, and still with black powder, no smokeless powder in this rifle.